Oh, I'm going to do anything. <laughs> well, no, no, thank you. I'm absolutely fine. I don't want to have banana split. No, Hot he's fudge not. Sunny. He's not going to have any of them. Thank you very much. Thank okay. you very much. Okay, well, just check. Just yeah, check. next time when she's not around. Okay, are you closing up? Uh, no. Nah, not yet. Just relax. Okay. Hey, no. Hey, John. Yeah, Ron? Do you know who this jacket belongs to? Search me. Well, somebody left it here and it's been hanging on that hook for days, so if you run into somebody who lost a jacket, this might be it. Have them check here, okay? Sure thing, Ron. What I'd like to talk about is a trip. A trip that you and I will take just as soon as Steve comes back. Gosh. I don't even know what to say to you about that. And what you ought to say is that you'll think about it. And please think about it. I think it'll be very good. Some time alone that I think we need. Talk things out. And I guarantee you it'll be a lot better than last summer. But you mean the three solid months of terror and worrying? Where was she? Was she still alive? Oh, yeah, I remember last summer. That's exactly what I mean, and I'm... I'm very happy to think that this summer will not be the same. In any way, shape, or form. No. This summer is going to be peaceful. Hey, hey, you know, Slick, I wanted to ask you something. Um, yeah. a few days ago... Rosie, somebody... wait a second. <clears throat> There's somebody in, in the kitchen wants to see you. Are you putting me on? I'm no, just in there. Nobody's I'm seen. not putting you on. Please. I'm serious. Okay. Uh, do you want some coffee? Yeah. Please? Okay. Yeah, let me have a cup of coffee. You might want to try the soup. Well, let me, let me look over the menu. Oh, okay. Coffee, please. Coming right up. Okay, uh, do you want anything else tonight? Or? No, thank you. That'll be fine. Okay. Uh, okay. <gasps> hey, people. Rosie, Rosie, be quiet, okay? How'd you get in here? Too bad, too bad. Boy, I've been so worried about you. It's so good to see you, but my... Gosh, where I know, did you I know. Get Don't these? get too close. I'm not alone in these clothes. Look, I'm really worried about Laura. I came here looking for Laura because oh, I can't find her. Nobody seems to know where she is. I thought I'd talk to her mother and father, but I can't go out there because that guy in the feathered hat is waiting oh. for me. So is it, now wait. No, just listen. Can you go out there? Is there any way you can get uh, Rick and Leslie to come in here? Please, please, yeah, come on, please. Okay, I'll try. Sure, thanks. I'd like you two to see my kitchen. Your kitchen? Yeah, yeah. Um, you have never seen it before, have you? Right. Right. No. Well, see, I've made some improvements. You won't be able to really appreciate it because you haven't seen it before, so I'd really like you to see it. Right. I think we better see your kitchen. I've been right sitting here all night wondering why nobody invited yeah. me to see the kitchen. You know, I, I, why didn't you invite me when I moved up? I have no idea. You could just walk in. You know, what do you need? Sure. Right. Where have Gosh. you... Ben. I'm, I'm so, is there some good reason you're dressed this way? I hope so, sir. I'm looking for Laura. Do you know where she is? She went looking for you. She went to Beecher's Corners. She figured she'd find you there. Oh, she went to Beecher's Corners? Yeah. Oh. Oh, that's great. Then there's no reason to worry. What do you mean by that? Well, it's, it's, I mean that she's safe. I mean, if she's in Beecher's Corners, she's safe. Are you absolutely sure about that, Luke? Yeah, Dr. Weber, I, uh, I'm positive. No doubt about it. Believe me. They, oh, sorry, I... Uh, Disturbed you. I'm just going to a costume party. <laughs> Thanks for coming and telling me. You're welcome. Thank you. You're all right. Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks. How come you never dress like that? So that's Who's your tailor. That's my new kitchen. Thanks. 
Doctor's Corners. Of course. Well, I loved your kitchen. I'm glad you got to see it.